my, my, my favorites. Hello everyone, I know this video is a couple of weeks late, however I managed to get tonsillitis and I've been so ill over the last couple of weeks, so it feels good to be well again, back doing a favourites video. I was going to leave it, but then I decided that actually I love making these videos and you guys seem to really enjoy them, and I picked up some good stuff in May, so let's go through it. Also, before I get started, what do you think of my new backdrop? I changed some stuff around in the studio. It's feeling good. I've got my rail here so I can take you through some of the stuff that I've picked up. And yeah, it means that I can literally come in here, just set up the camera and start filming, which is very good, which means that I can make a bunch of videos without having a long setup time. Also, the studio is looking really good at the moment. It's almost finished to show you guys. So I'm gonna do a full studio tour video for you guys to see, but it's not quite ready, it's getting there, but I promise I'll make a nice video when it's all done. All right, let's get into it. First favorite of the month. You may have noticed that I'm wearing glasses. Now, for those of you that have been subscribed for a while will know that I wear glasses, but I haven't been wearing them um, in videos or anything just because I don't actually like the glasses that I had. Um, so I've been searching for a new pair of specs for ages and I just haven't been able to, I just can't talk. I haven't been able to find a pair that I've really liked. However, when Alex and I were in LA the other month, um, we were walking down a road called Labria Avenue. I think it's Labria Avenue. Um, which is an amazing road and it's got loads of like kind of streetwear brands and some cool um, other shops but they've also got a shop called Garrett Light who do sunglasses and spectacles like this. So I went in there and I found these guys and I was like yes this is what I've been waiting for to find. So I bought the um, the frames over there and then got them like my prescription put in back here but I'm really happy with them. They're kind of like retro kind of vibe but I think they'll be pretty timeless and they're slightly Harry Potter. I don't know, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. But I'm, yeah, I'm really happy with them. Like I said, I've been looking for a good pair of glasses for a long time. So yeah, let me know. That is my first favorite, Garrett Light. Awesome. Okay, so favorite number two of the month is this sweater that I'm wearing. And it is by a brand called Kith. Now, a bunch of you guys will know who they are. You'll know that it was started by a guy called Ronnie Feig, who is massively influential in the streetwear world. He's done some amazing collaborations um, in terms of like sneakers. So he's done collaborations like Adidas and people like that. So yeah, this is part of their spring summer um, collection. So SS16. And yeah, I mean, it's awesome. Like the fabric's really, really nice. It fits like perfectly. It's just really comfortable. And I think it's really interesting that like, there's some tassels here. I'll show you guys what it looks like on properly. But yeah, I think that they've done a really, really good job on the kind of in-house brand that they've created. Um, I like it, I liked it so much actually that I ordered another one. So I've got another one coming in the post um, in a different color. But yeah, Ronnie, if you're watching this, which you're probably not, um, but if you do see this, amazing job on the collection. Um, awesome, awesome clothes, man. Like really, really think you guys did a great job and keep it up. Yeah, great stores. It's one of my favorite stores that I've been to actually, I think, the, the one in Soho. I need to check out the one in Brooklyn as well, but very, very cool store. Anyway, right, let's get on to the next favorite. Favorite number three. Now, it wouldn't be a favorites video if I didn't chuck in a pair of sneakers. I'm loving these right now. I think Adidas are literally just killing the game. They're killing the sneaker game at the moment. Most of my pickups have been Adidas recently just because I think they're doing the most interesting stuff um, and the ultra, boot, the ultra Boost technology is just so comfortable. It's so, so comfortable. These are the Triple White 2.0. Um, and I absolutely love these. You can see I've been wearing them quite a lot recently. But yeah, I feel like if you're into sneakers, which I know a bunch of you guys are, you've got to have a pair of Ultra Boosts in your collection. Um, I think these ones are relatively hard to get. I mean, as you guys know, Ultra Boosts, like when they come online, they just go real quick, they get sold out. But I got these from Cali Roots, I think. Um, and I managed to grab them real, real easy, actually. There was no like, um, waiting around and no crashing, like I just put them in the cart and grabbed them, so that was good. And yeah, just really liking them, they're so comfortable, I feel like they go with a bunch of things, and these are definitely in my rotation at the moment, and they are gonna be awesome for the summer. Really, really looking forward to rocking these with shorts and like crop trousers and stuff like that. So, Adidas Ultra Boost Triple White 2.0. 
good job at it us, keep it up. Now my next favourite is a bit of a random one I think, but as you guys know I've been doing up the studio and I've been buying things to try and make it look nice and feel a bit more like my space. Um, so basically I picked up this cushion, this good vibes cushion. Now I think this is awesome, like I just saw it online on Urban Outfitters and I was like yeah man, good vibes, that's what I want the studio to be like. So I picked up this and it goes really nicely, yeah, simple. Good vibes cushion, favourite number four, boom. So my next favourite is also an item that I bought for the studio and I've wanted this ever since my friend um, Hayden showed me it because he's been creating artwork for the platform. Um, he goes by the name of Zoloch, a bunch of you guys will know but he does amazing kind of gifs and animation and stuff like that which you'll see but basically it's a screen it's by a company called electric objects and it comes with this app i'm going to show you guys here if it will focus come on focus 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 there we go so that is me it's on here and you can see all the artwork and it basically if i change it on my phone it changes it on the screen um, so I've currently got my friend um, Hayden's artwork on there and I just thought it was a really nice um, piece to add to the studio because obviously I take a lot of pictures so I can display my own images on there but also it's a great way to showcase someone like um, Hayden's artwork as well and when people come in it's been a talking point because they're like oh that's cool and then they notice that it moves so I just think it's really beautiful, it's really really well made um, I can't remember how much it was, I think it was a couple of hundred dollars um, but then the thing to bear in mind, if you are from the UK or Europe, um, you'll have to pay um, like uh, custom tax on it, which I think was like £40 or something. So definitely worth it. Um, but yeah, awesome. I've been really enjoying it. And it's cool just to have like fresh artwork on the wall, basically. So I can keep changing on the artwork. And yeah, it's just a, it's just a great thing. I've, I've had people come in and really enjoy it. And I've just really been enjoying it as well. So awesome awesome favorite that is for me and if you do want to check out my friend Hayden's artwork I'll link all of his links in the description below very talented guy and I think his artwork is super unique so go and show him some love as well so next up is a TV series that Alex and I have become so addicted to it's called Peaky Blinders I'm sure a bunch of you guys have already watched it but it is unreal it's got Killian Murphy in it and I just think it is an amazing amazing series it's set in Birmingham I think in the 1920s um, and it's basically about uh, a gang called the Peaky Blinders and basically them kind of having turf wars with other gangs and trying to control Birmingham and then move out to different locations. But if you like that kind of old school gangster type vibe, it is definitely for you. I think cinematically it's amazing. The storyline's really, really great. And yeah, Alex and I have just become so addicted to it. So Peaky Blinders, I think you can get it on Netflix, the first couple of series, but then iTunes and iPlayer and stuff like that. So Peaky Blinders is phenomenal, definitely, definitely worth checking out. And we have another pair of sneakers. Massive shout out to Hanon for helping me grab these. And I just love, this is why I love Adidas, just because like that is such a unique sneaker. Like it's awesome. You guys will know in my last pair, I had the other city socks as well, the glow in the dark ones, but these are clean, man. I love these. And I just think Adidas are killing it right now. They're just releasing so many good pairs of sneakers. Like, I only pick up stuff that I really like, um, and these I'm a massive fan of. Because they're kind of like the, like the desert boot versions that they did, just obviously without that. And it's like very, very comfortable, like wearing socks, because they pretty much are socks, hence the name. But yeah, thank you to Hanon, awesome shoe. I don't think you can grab them just because I think they went out really quick again, but I think you can probably find some websites or eBay or whatever if you're really into them. Um, but yeah, City Socks, another pair for me. Loving them, absolutely loving them. And my last favourite of the month is this t-shirt that I picked up. It's Y3, it's the Adidas um, Yoji Yamamoto collaboration. I just thought it was really nice, quite unique as well. It's got these kind of like little threads here going through, really subtle. Um, but yeah, love this. Like, I've been really into like t-shirts recently. Like I used to wear a lot of shirts, but obviously moving into summer and stuff like that and just like, also I like to layer stuff as well. So t-shirts have been a big part of that. Um, but it's just really well made. Like it's really, really comfortable. And yeah, I just thought it was kind of subtle, but look, looks pretty, pretty nice, pretty premium. Like they did a good job with this. I got it from the, um, the Y3 website. I'm sure they've still got a bunch of them left, um, but yeah, definitely recommend this 
very cool t-shirt man really digging that really really digging that okay so there you go they have been my May favorites I hope you guys have enjoyed this video I'm really sorry that it is a couple of weeks late but like I said I was in bed resting with tonsillitis but it feels so good to be well again and healthy and making videos so yeah if you have liked the video make sure you like it and subscribe for more videos like this and i'll see you guys in a couple of days with a sneaker collection video which is really exciting because i know a lot of you have been asking about that so yeah i hope you have liked the video and i'll see you in a few days okay bye bye